you know, I really wish I had some sitar music or something. Little Robbie Shankar, also known as Nora Jones' dad. Uh, some some sitar music, you know, some, uh, what are they called, tablas in the background. Yeah, I should, I should come up with some, some Bollywood music or something. Because we're reviewing an Indian snuff. This one, I uh, got, it, this is not obviously the factory package. Uh, I got this from my friend Jake as part of a trade. And this is Six Photos Cheetah. Cheetah, I believe, comes in a yellow tin, ordinarily, or blue. I, I don't, hell, I don't know. Colorblind as well as blind, you know. Um, now, I've been doing snuff reviews, you can tell. I mean, kind of got a snot nose going here. And I've put a bunch of different scents up my nose already. I've put up the M4X, the medicated. I did the Goddard chocolate today. Uh, and plus I did my regular, you know, every day, the snuffs I enjoy as my morning snuffs with my morning coffee. Um, and uh, I've had a lot of snuff today. Haven't had a lot of nicotine. Most of the snuffs I've taken have been, excuse me, have been extremely low. Uh, relatively speaking, in nicotine. And one thing I've heard about this cheetah is, like many of the Indian snuffs, it blows your doors off with vitamin N. Let's find out. I also understand this one is a bitch to take. It's powdery, it burns, it's not as bad as the Dalakia Willie Peat or Dalali Tap or some of the other nose burners that are part of the FUBAR line. But it is an Indian snuff, it's going to hurt. I know it's going to hurt. It's going to hurt! Mommy, I don't want to do the cheetah. It's going to hurt. All right. Nice little container, though, that Jake sent me this in. I wonder if this used to have oil of Olay or something in it. All right. Yeah, grind is fine. Fine, fine, fine. Dusty, powdery, dusty, powdery. Y'all want to look at it on camera? Maybe I can tip this. Hang on a second. Got to do a thing where I touch my screen and maybe you can sort of see it without me getting snuff all over me. All right, can you see that? Yeah. All right. You notice it stayed in the container pretty well, so it means it's got a little moisture to it, but it's pretty powdery. It's... Wow. It's not at all what I expected the smell to be. I expected just like a raw tobacco smell. This is perfumey. It smells really nice. I'm getting some cardamom maybe in there. Wow. Oh, yeah, it burns. I need the nicotine, though. And I have no doubt that this is going to really pump it up. Take another one. Ouch. Yeah, it's got some burner to it. Thank God my nost my nostrils, thank God my nostrils are partly closed from all the snuff that I've done today. And my noise is, nose, see, I can't talk today, it's Monday. Uh, let me start over. Thank goodness that I've already done a lot of snuff today because my nose is moistened, my nostrils are moistened, and the nostrils are partially closed from a little bit of snuff abuse. So I'm having less of a difficult time than I might have with this had I open nostrils, completely open, dry nostrils. Oh, but Lord God, it burns! Ooh, yeah. That's making me cry. I was crying at everything. Oh. Wow. Oh, yeah, she got some nicotine. <clears throat> wow. Yeah, I'm feeling that pulse. Oh, that's nice. The scent is a fragrant, not overpowering spice scent in the sense of... Uh, Indian spices. It's got some lime in it for sure. Oh, it burns so good. Oh, there is some nicotine in there. 
Yee! Woo! Made me dizzy. All right, if you guys are looking for the Nick Blast, this may be one to have in your arsenal. It's tough to take. I will say this for a beginner, this ain't your snuff. Sorry, this is not a good beginner snuff. Uh, because it is so fine, and it does burn. It burns like a bastard when you take it. Now that the burn has subsided, I've gotten that initial punch of nicotine, and the drip burns almost as bad as the sniff. Yeah, the drain, the drip down the back of your throat, not unpleasant. You sure feel it. Uh, this is one that's going to require two different ratings. For an experienced snuff user who wants a lot of nicotine in a somewhat difficult to take, but in the end very pleasant snuff, this will rate a 5 out of 5. This is good. If you're a beginner, I would avoid this one like herpes until I got a little bit more experience in snuff taking and we're more accustomed to the way that snuff delivers nicotine to the bloodstream. I, I can't recommend this for beginners. Beginners, this would rate a 3, but for experienced snuff takers, uh, and I'm an experienced snuff taker, and this is, <coughs> wow, <coughs> from the dank basement, 5 out of 5 for the experienced snuff taker, 3 out of 5 for a novice, this is the Cheetah from Six Photo. Got this one in a trade from my good friend Jake. Thank you so much, Jake, for sending this to me to review. I appreciate it. I probably, I got a big box of Indians here. Hang on. Yeah, this is my box of Indian snuffs. I got a whole bunch of different ones here. Might even have some of the Cheetah in this batch. These are all Six Photo, I think. Ah. Uh, Oh, I am not kidding you. The nicotine on this is impressive. Makes me want to go up and go out and pick up a truck and carry it around town. All right, enough of my silliness. From the gang Dason. From the gay banknet. From the douche bushnet. You know. This is Uncle Squinty. Thank you.